Hi class, today we're going to start the lesson off um, with a little poem called Five Little Seashells by Louise Scott. At the end of the poem, we're going to decide if we did addition or subtraction. So here we go. Five little seashells sleeping on the shore, swish went a wave and then there were four. Four little seashells, quiet as could be, swish went a wave and then there were three. Three little seashells, pearly and new, swish went a wave and then there were two. Two little seashells lying in the sun, swish went a wave and then there were, and then there was one. One little seashell left all alone, I put it in my bucket and then I took it home. So now we have zero seashells. So the question is, did we do addition and get more seashells? Or did we do subtraction and get less seashells? Yes, we did subtraction. We ended up with zero, right? So when we subtract, we use the minus symbol, which means to take away. So what we're gonna do is do some subtraction number stories. So grab a pencil and a paper because we're going to write equations together. Okay, I hope you have your pencil and your paper and we're going to get started. So let's count how many seashells we have on the shore. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we are starting with ten seashells. All right, and the waves are going to come and they're going to take some seashells away. So we have 10 seashells, a big wave comes and it takes away one, two, three. So I'm taking away three seashells. I'm subtracting three, right? So we had 10 and I took away three. So I'm gonna put the three here, one, two, three. Let's see how many seashells we have left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We had 10, three washed away, and now we have seven. What equation could we write? We always, we always start with the number that we had first. So the number that we started with was the number 10. So let's write the number 10. because they washed away, they, we subtracted, right? So we're gonna use a minus sign. So 10 minus how many were subtracted? One, two, three. Equals, right? We took away three and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven seashells. So 10 minus three equals seven. Let's try another. So now we're gonna start off with how many? Seven, so now we have seven seashells. There we go. Clean my board. All right, so now we have seven seashells on the shore that was a tongue twister and a wave comes and we're gonna wash away one two right so we had seven and two washed away so let's see how many we have one two three four five we have five so we started with seven right we subtracted how many one two right that's how many we took away minus two equals right and we have how many one two three four five five on the shore seven minus two equals five all right let's do another and when you subtract you get less all right here we go we have one two three four five five seashells on the shore. Here comes our wave. One, two, three. So we took away three. Oops, sorry. So one, two, three. We had five. 
and we took away one, two, three, and now we have two, right? So we started with the number five. We subtracted, right, minus one, two, three. We took away three, and now we have two. Five minus three equals two. All right, last one. This eraser isn't the best. Okay, we have two seashells on the shore. Here comes the wave. All right, let me move that. Here comes the wave. Whoosh. Right, and now we have zero. There are zero seashells. So we had, how many do we have? We had two. We took away how many? Two. And now we have zero. So let's write it. Two minus, how many did we take away? Two. We subtracted two. Equals, dun da da da, zero. Two minus two equals zero. Remember when you subtract, you take away. So we subtracted, we did subtraction today. The minus symbol means to take away. And now we have, we had 10, and we took all 10 away slowly, bit by bit, and now we have zero seashells left.